Hey, what's going on guys? This video we've been doing a gaming demo with the OnePlus 2. So basically I'm playing some high graphic Android games with this device. So what I'm basically doing is pushing the GPU and CPU to its maximum potential, see what kind of results we can get. So the title of each video game that I'll be playing it will pop up here after each segment changes. And also I'll let you know if the device gets, uh, if it stays rather cool after all this gameplay, does it get warm or does it get hot. Because uh, some phones do get a little bit warm or hot depending on how much games you play. Furthermore, some games allow for maxing out the graphics. Um, if they do allow that option, it will max out the graphics. Some games don't allow that option. They have like a set standard uh, graphic setting. You can't change it. Obviously, I can't do anything about it. So any game that does allow it, I'll be pushing it to its max potential. So let's get straight into it. Oh, Jesus. Oh, God, what a horrible game. Killing these animals and then it gives you like rock music. Damn, you killed a goat.
orders concerning you, so it let you go. But it raised the alarm. Go to the generator, quickly! I'm sorry for this complication, but there is no other way. Let these zombies out. Yeah, it's a game bugged out on me. Strike two to Monarch. Target eliminated. Confirm extraction location. Over. Now hold up. Come on. Let's go. Thanks. Definitely buggy. <laughs> Thank you. 
Jeez, what the heck? Noise. Okay, so the testing has been completed, and uh, for the most part, it's not bad. Now, there were some games that kind of stuttered a little bit. Uh, for example, DC's uh, Justice Gods Among Us. Um, you can't really see it on camera, but in person with my own eyes, I can see a little bit. FIFA did lag just a tiny bit, um, and then it kind of got some audio messed up. Um, Dead Effect, obviously, was a game with uh, some of the best graphics I've ever seen on an Android game. But again, there's a little bit of uh, frame droppage. Despite it having some superb specs, I found that basically uh, the HTC One M9, which has similar specs, fared better than this device. Now it's actually a few months old compared to this. Um, I'm not bashing on it. I mean, for the price point, you can't complain. I'm not complaining. I'm just stating the facts. Um, one other thing to keep in mind is that the the phone got quite warm. Uh, Actually, it was borderline hot where I was starting to get worried, um, mostly in this area here. I'm not sure why, but it's kind of strange, but yeah, this area here, a little bit at the back here, it got rather warm to the point where it was almost really hot. I was like, should I turn it off or not? But yeah, something to keep in mind. So be sure to check out the review video in which I go into much more details regarding this device. You can find links to that, camera sample videos as well in the video description. Be sure to hit that like button, it does help. Subscribe, and thanks for watching.